Hi everybody, it's Miss Lauren and I'm here at the library today, the Glen Cove Public Library, and I'm taking a little break to read you How to Trap a Leprechaun. I thought this would be a nice story to share seeing how St. Patrick's Day is coming up. And this book is very colorful and fun. Legend tells of tiny elves who visit once a year. They'll steal your treasure for themselves and quickly disappear. If you catch a leprechaun, he'll grant a wish, I'm told. But if he gets away too bad, no wish, no luck, no gold. Poof! Small and full of trickery, they'll fool you if they can. Catching one takes smarts and skill, but most of all, a plan. Let's see if they can catch a leprechaun with their plan. The night before St. Patrick's Day, the leprechauns appear. If you wish to capture one, you'll need the proper gear. First, you'll need to build a trap one he can't escape. Grab a box, a bottle cap, and some glitter. Glue and tape. Wonder what they're gonna build. Let's see. Use gold paint to coat the rocks. He will think they're real. Scatter them inside the box, and he will come to steal. Pour some glue inside the box and build a rainbow slide. He'll take a ride to find the gold, but find he's stuck inside. Leprechauns come out at night so they can sneak around. Now close the drapes and dim the light and wait without a sound. See if he comes. Did you hear that? Crinkle snap. Quickly check your stare. Shucks, he just escaped the trap. He could be anywhere. Where could he be? Look at this. He left his shoe and inside the shoe a note. Tiny words addressed to you, and this is what he wrote. Dear children, thanks for the glitter and shiny gold rocks, but I can't be trapped by a cardboard box. Your tricks were quite clever, your trap was so great, but it takes more than rainbows to seal my fate, signed Liam the Leprechaun. It's a shame he got away, but please don't shed a tear. Go enjoy St. Patrick's Day and try again next year. The end. What a, what a fun book. I'm glad you came to visit with me and, and share the book with me. And I hope you'll come see us at the library. Bye-bye.